And helping your child manage stress in the aftermath of a tragic event can be challenging, but having that conversation is a must with them. Fox 44's Vanya Joseph has ways to help us parents navigate that conversation. It's scary as a parent, and I think it's scary for, for kids too, for sure. Another mass shooting, 19 children dead. A sinking feeling is all too familiar, especially for parents, but communicating these tragic events with your children while processing them yourself can be complicated. Parents typically like know their kids and know their maturity level. And as far as ages go, we know with other big topics, we know about age appropriate conversation. Licensed professional counselor Anita Lopez says when talking to kids about tragic events, it's important to create a safe space for open dialogue. All kids are different and so they're going to have different feelings and different interpretations and different thoughts. Validate your kids feelings and just show up. Make the space. Lopez says parents have to first process their own emotional response to avoid projecting possible fears on their children. You don't want your kids to be not like afraid of living life. Lopez also recommends keeping explanations simple and letting your kids questions guide the conversation while validating their feelings. The thing to normalize with kids is their emotions about abnormal events that it does keep happening. That doesn't mean it's normal. Validating feelings isn't the same as validating a thing that happened or a thing someone does. Vanya Joseph Fox 44 News.